PRP is an acronym that stands for platelet-rich plasma, which, of course, is injectable. Platelets are one of the very fundamental cells in your bloodstream, and there are lots and millions of platelets floating around your bloodstream. These platelets are full of what we call growth factors, meaning they stimulate new growth in, uh, in certain kinds of, of tissue, especially tissue that supports joints. To get the platelets, uh, they come from the patient. Uh, we draw their blood, we then take that blood and we put it through a centrifuge, which then concentrates the platelets. We take those platelets and then inject them into the structures where we want to promote new growth. And this often is into tendons or ligaments that uh, support a particular joint, say the elbow or the shoulder or the knee. In my case, I apply the same principles uh, to the spine. Not very many practitioners have yet applied this same, these same principles to the spine. There are a great many citizens who have um, low back pain, chronic low back pain. And a major source of that low back pain is arthritis, particularly in, the, in these lower joints. Uh, this is the, the low back is also known as the lumbar region. And when these joints, uh, which we call facet joints, become arthritic, it can cause a great deal of uh, stiffness uh, and uh, aching and soreness in the low back. These joints are all supported by ligaments and the, uh, the uh, platelet-rich plasma, uh, in this case, would be deployed right into where the ligaments attach to these various uh, bony structures which would then stimulate new growth in the ligaments and make the, uh, the joints more supported which in turn would uh, typically reduce this pain. In the cervical region, uh, in the neck region, I have found that not only do the, uh, these type of injections help with the neck stiffness and, and neck pain, but it also very much helps with the headache. And in a number of cases, people actually uh, have uh, more discomfort from the headache than the, than the actual neck pain. And I've been uh, extremely pleased with uh, the outcomes. I first um, started employing this technique on the spine probably about two and a half years ago, initially starting uh, in the lumbar uh, or low back region. And then after about a year and a half or so, I uh, began uh, working with the cervical, the neck region as well. And uh, typically, I recommend um, a set of two treatments uh, on whatever the symptomatic area is. Very often, patients are symptomatic on both sides. One side may be worse than the other. So I typically would take the side that hurts the most and do a treatment, and then two to four weeks later, do a follow-up treatment. And my experience is that patients are getting uh, an, at least six months and in many cases a year or longer before they come back and say, you know, I'm starting to feel that discomfort in this area again.